Now, I suppose the question around vision is, what are we for? So what are, what are our values and what is our purpose? And some of you will have um, already a sense of, of what we've been doing over the last year. So we've, we've developed, amongst all the contributions to the idea of values, we couldn't settle on a, a simple mission statement. We couldn't say, this is, this is our single purpose. So it seemed more appropriate to have a tree of values, a number of different values, those below the ground, I suppose, which are the roots, which are our ethos, and those above the grounds, which is our ambitions for learners, our offer, if you like. Um, and it's sort of neatly summed up in this phrase that all, adult learning, learning Lewisham, all together we flourish, which I think is a, a simple way of remembering what I think our vision is, which is that um, the all is the what. So we are a learning provider, we're a business, we're also a council service. So we're three things in one. And as all of them, we need to have sort of stable finances, we need to have a secure future, strong foundations. The, um, the how. So it's harder and harder to work alone now. We can't achieve our ambitions to reach the, the particularly um, some of the targeted groups that we're trying to reach. And that we think this vision is best achieved through partnership. So together. And that partnership is us in this room. It's us with the learners. It's us looking out into the world to our neighbouring services in Lawrence House and to, hi there, and to um, uh, other organisations in the borough. And then the why. And we've... The, 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 the concept of flourishing is a deep Aristotelian concept of flourishing. So this is flourishing which is quite hard work. Learning is quite hard work. But the ultimate goal is that you're living a life where you're doing well, you're faring well, you're living well, you're fulfilling your potential. So Altogether We Flourish is really a simple package of the, the what, the how and the why of our vision. The local context, so we know that... Um, sneakily, George Osborne, straight away after last year's election, without waiting for the budget, he put in some cuts. Those cuts were, for us, in-year cuts. So we had already planned for the whole of this year, hello, hello, and um, an in-year cut is a traumatic cut for most businesses. Colleges suffered a lot. We went ahead with the programme as planned, but we do have to now think about adjusting for those cuts. There were around 400,000 of cuts last year. And then we have a 1% pay award, it's not very much, it's a national pay award that we have to then distribute, and we have to also pay increased national insurance contributions of around 3.3%. So we're looking at about 20% or so as, as, a, as a series of savings, but those partnerships I was talking about, which may include a local college that's near to us, that is underspent, that is looking to fund some of our courses. So there is a chance that this term we will be drawing down some of some funding as, as um, a partner from Lewisham and Southwark College. So watch this space. That won't apply to all courses, only a small number of courses. But, but we'll see it as a pilot. We know Lewisham and Southwark College could be improved, and we can help, I think we can help do it. But it will be very hands-off. There is no discussion or any thought on either side about merge or anything like that. We want a genuine, strong college in this borough. Um, and we think we can help them do it. The regional context, you'll have heard perhaps people talking about the, the review of colleges, college mergers are in the news a lot, because it's all under review. There's errors of reviews all across the country. And in London, the, the further education error review has already started. Hi there. Um, now, adult learning provision was, was uh, given the chance to opt in, and we decided to think about it, and, and we put pressure on the... Um, on, government on business innovation and skills to run a parallel review so we're not lumped in with colleges so we're actually part of a, an adult learner review in London which is very very good it will feed in to the new model for adult learning which is a devolved model across the country so London will have its own funding if the new mayor signs this agreement and we can't imagine why they wouldn't there will be a, a funding commissioner for London and we wouldn't get funding from um, central government anymore. It would come through the GLA. And that move is accompanied by a move to commissioning. So they will be looking at regions of London saying we want this much ESOL over here, this much engineering over here, this much arts provision over here and then we will have to say why we are the best provider for it. And that's in two years time. So part of this think tank is for us to think, right, we've got a year or so to prepare the ground to show we're brilliant. We meet learner needs and we deliver on outcomes. 
This last point is just about moving away from enrolments. We don't just get funding now for enrolments. We're actually going to be funded by outcome. So again, you know the ILPs are all about impact, all about outcome. So your work is critical, absolutely critical, to us demonstrating to funders that we're worth funding, we're valuable in the future. Um, okay, so this is the challenge for, for us as an uh, as, um, uh, adult learning provider in Lewisham. Um, what can we do? Well, we need to look at what the community needs are. We need to get some data around that. We need to design a curriculum and courses that meet those <coughs> needs. And we need to persuade funders of the values of our learner journey. We need, well, what, what can you do as tutors? As you, do, as you do, understand the needs of those learners in your class. Understand why your class is of value to your communities. Um, help your learners meet those goals that they come in and talk about at the beginning and where learners are reticent, because they often are, they don't know why they've come to a class, help them understand actually that we're here, we're publicly funded, we're taxpayer funded in most cases, apart from studio classes, and that we want them to make a difference to their life after the course. Um, so encouraging learners, this can't be something we do our, ourselves, it, it must be something the learners are involved with.